Hello and welcome to Hansgrohe Technical Talk. My name is Keith Dyson. I hope you enjoy this short demonstration. I'm going to demonstrate some key points with the iBox. The iBox is a one-box solution and suits most Hansgrohe and Axel valves, from thermostat to thermostat flow control to manual valves to diverters, and it even goes together with some overhead showers. It can be installed any way around because we have mirror image ports. The correct plumbing fitting to use is a three-quarter male iron fitting. When installing with a thermostat, you must always pipe up hot to the left and cold to the right. We have an adjustable fixation ring which adjusts into three different depths for ease of installation and also fixations on the back of the eye box. On the front we have levelling lugs to place your level on there to aid levelling. And we also have a sticker on here to, on a guide to how deep to install the eye box within the wall. And the measurement is between 80 and 108 millimetres and that's to the front face of the tile. Inside we have a flushing block and testing block. This is to allow you to test out all your pipe work and make sure everything's sound before you seal up the wall. With regards to the flushing side of things, I'm going to remove the flushing block to explain how this works. So the flushing block, moulded into it, has channels which links the ports so you can flush all the water to the outlets. So for argument's sake, you've got the right hand port and you want to flush out to the top. This is in the correct orientation, but you want to have the water flushing to the bottom exit from the right port. To do this, you simply remove the flushing block, turn it 90 degrees and the right port then is linked to the bottom port. So to show you that again, right port to top port, 90 degrees turn, right port to bottom. The small red plug in there is to place inside the eye box so while flushing if you don't want water to come out of the bottom of the eye box you place a red plug inside like so and then you place the flushing block on top of the red plug and you can carry on flushing all your pipe work to the top exit thank you for watching